So today's officially the first day of March, which means we are now one week away from the baby lion's first birthday, and boy does he look excited. Last night we ordered pizza, started watching a movie, we got Bob the Builder sitting on the couch, casually playing the drums. Mother Goose obviously dropped their crust, the baby lion almost grabbed it, choked, and died. We made ourselves some popcorn, the baby lion went to his favorite rug, did the chicken wing, and then he got a little sleepy, and he literally didn't make it into the cage, he fell asleep at the entrance. Mother Goose made a Greek salad with a bunch of teardrops in it, shortly after she showed me the package, and apparently they're called Sweetie Drops, which low-key was kinda cute, but made a lot of sense. Now it's the next day, the baby lion's tail's on fire, we turn on the sink, get our hands a little wet, under the water, go ahead and hydrate prickly the bonsai tree, hydrate Bob the Builder, and of course hydrate Baby Lion, which I don't think he really appreciates. Speaking of our low fluffy friend, he grabs his favorite ball, casually rolls it with his paw towards Bob the Builder, so I low key felt bad and I wanted to play with so him. So I ended up throwing both of them at the exact same time and he didn't really know what to do, so I guess he decided to just hover in the sky for a bit, which was kind of concerning. All of a sudden, he has to potty. Obviously, he has to grab his ball before he heads out, but he makes it outside, licks the snow, gets zoned out. I tap the window, he has a mouth. So I grab my daily vitamins. This says men's hashtag adulting. We all dress up, ready to go out, and guess who's waiting at the door saying, Take me with you.